Skip counting lets you count by multiples of two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, or even more. It's a great way to learn to multiply numbers together. Let's give it a try. Let's do skip counting by fours. It means you only count every fourth number. Watch me do it. You'll hear me bounce four times, but I only count every fourth number I land on. Four. Eight. Twelve. Sixteen. Twenty. Twenty-four. 28 32 36 40 Let's do it again. This time, I'll count the bounces and you count the number I land on after the fourth bounce. Remember to keep silent after the first three bounces because we're skipping those numbers. One, two, three, four. 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 You can do skip counting yourself with a pen and a piece of paper. You can draw arrows to represent the bounces and circle every fourth number. Let's use skip counting by fours to count the number of balloons that cross the dotted line. Remember only to call out the number of every fourth balloon that crosses the line. Four, eight, twelve, sixteen, twenty, twenty-four, twenty-eight, 32, 36, 40. Let's do it one more time without numbers on the balloons. Count them off in groups of four as they cross the dotted line. Four, eight, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28, 32, 36, 40. If you can do skip counting, it makes learning the times tables easier. Skip counting by fours and the four times table both involve counting in multiples of four. Four times one is four Four times two is eight Four times three is twelve Four times four is sixteen Four times five is twenty 
Four times six is twenty-four. Four times seven is twenty-eight. Four times eight is thirty-two. Four times nine is thirty-six. Four times ten is forty. Four times eleven is forty-four. Four times twelve is forty-eight. <laughs>